All right, this is where we're letting Sunny go at. A little dried up area of, not completely dry, but on Briar Creek. This spot ain't completely dry, then it's a good spot. Trying to just make sure he has enough stuff around to be able to survive. And this is little Sunny. Beautiful little snake. Oh, red tongue. We fed him a nice, nice mouse last week, I believe. Mm hmm. He's done pretty much digested that mouse. So now he is good and ready to find something else, and he's got enough to go on for quite a while. Yeah, he'll be able to do it on his own this now it's like this is all so new where'd he go I see him you want to put him in the water yeah It went fall. Some people call these guys Highland moccasins. You do see around a lot of water. But uh, this was uh, this is a regular Southern Copperhead, a Keister John, Contortrix, Contortrix. I don't think he's wanting much to do with the water. Put him in there gently. your plans are now. You're gonna put me in the water. Alright, Bo. I see you. You're getting a little swift. Yes, yes, go back that way. Go on. Being a pit viper, he should float pretty much. They have a higher fat content than our regular non-venomous snakes, so instead of just a head being on the water, you'll see quite a bit of their body stays on top of the water, see? You don't want to be in the water. Can you get him out a little bit deeper? I'm sorry, Sonny. All right. <laughs> you really don't want to be in the water. He says, no. No, why are you doing this? He reminds me of a cat. Sorry, boogie. See how that body stays pretty much on top of the water? We'll leave him alone now, John. We'll just let him do what he's going to do. Let him have his little fun. All right, Sonny. It was nice knowing you, and I hope... Goodbye. We had him for about how long? Almost a year? A little over a year now. I hope I was able to get you off to a decent start. When I first got him, he was able to coil up in the bottom of a... Uh... I think I think I want to put him in some, some of that tall grass over here. That's that cool. Coke bottle. He's able to coil up in the bottom of a Coke bottle and... Uh, now he would, he he wasn't able to eat full-grown mice when I first got him. So I think he hates the sight of this stick now. He's getting upset with it. I want to nope. put him in the tall grass so so no raccoons or anything comes ambling along and finds his little butt. Yeah. Come on, you be mad. Up, Explosive.
He's done wise on up to that stick. Now he's getting angry. Come on, honey. I think you're a lot safer down here in that grass. And the last of the little sun sand. And they can live up to what, about 20 years in a while. Uh, I don't know. I don't know about teens really more. I don't know about copperheads that much. As far as their life expectancy, life span. And let's see it. We're gonna let him get one more. I'd like to get one more shot of his face, but I don't think he's gonna let us. Goodbye, little son. Goodbye. He's all coiled up in there. There he is. All right, Sonny. Nice knowing you. Be careful out here.